guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Shernice and welcome back to Simply Niqua. So today I have an awesome book review video for you guys again this week, two weeks in a row. So awesome and I'm so excited to tell you more about this book. I love it so much. And if you missed last week's book review over Blood of Zeus by Meredith Wilde and Angel Payne, you're missing out. Go down below and click on that video and check it out after this one. But if you want to know more about this awesome new book that I have read, then sit back and relax and continue watching. But before you do, go down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel, please, if you haven't already. Give me a like, give me a comment if you want, and let's get started with this video. <laughs> So you guys, the awesome book that I'm going to talk to you guys about is by the lovely, the one and only Kendall Ryan. And her new book that's coming out today, guys, is coming out today, and it is called Penthouse Prince. Like right there, the title is lovely. So let me tell you a little bit about the story. So this wonderful story involves around the penthouse prince, and his name is Lexington Dane, and he is a realty person, you know, he has his realty business, and it has grown, and it's big time, and he's doing his thing in the realty business. To give a little scratch of the story, but it's not any spoilers because it's in the back of the book of what Kendall Ryan has wrote, so you, you read that there, you'll see this part, but, but he has a daughter, Lexington Dane has has a best friend his name is Doc yeah I want to say Doc is D-A-K and they have been best friends since they were little and Doc has a sister and her name is Corgan I really really love her name um, it's very interesting and different it's Corgan her name is Corgan Stewart she is the other main character in the story and so here's that triangle there since Lexington was Doc's best friend, so Corgan was always around and they were all kind of close in age, so it was great. Long story short, to fast forward, Lexington was always Corgan's first. First kiss, first love, first. Her first. And what stupid high school boys do and not really think about anything, he uh, left Corgan and not without an explanation, all the above to go to college, blah, blah, blah. I don't want to give you too much of the story, but that's kind of like the basic. And now Corgan has grown up and she is a teacher. She's an elementary teacher as well and she teaches for a living. One thing leads to another in the book and allows Corgan and Lexington to come back together. And that's where you see their story to grow when they once they get back together. And it's just a really awesome story to see here the background to where they are now today as grown adults. And just the interesting vibe and everything that comes about throughout the pages of this book. I really want to say that like, this story is so perfect and I really, really enjoyed reading this. Every single page, every single word that I read, I really enjoyed reading this. It was just a perfect story, a perfect story that I needed at this time and just and a perfect story that I really just wanted to read. This book is in both point of views, like always, I love that, and so it's in Lexington's and Corgan's point of view. And this book has about 21 chapters. Let me make sure. This book has 20 chapters with an epilogue, a beautiful epilogue, I would say. I really enjoyed that last last little piece. So, but there's 20 chapters with an epilogue, which I call it 21 chapters. So this is a great length of a book. A little bit more of what I have seen after reading this book. I believe this book is about true love. Because, like, you always hear that if there's true love, regardless when you um, interact with that person, you always will come back to that person if you're meant to be with that particular person. <laughs> and so I believe that is what this book is showing because Lexington and Corgan was together and they're unstoppable and they were great together. But then he went away, went away for 10 years I would say. and came back and it was just a happy ever after ending for both of them and even after all those years have went by they still love each other and they still have that true love and I feel that's what this story is about how true love really lasts if it's really true and that's why I believe 
what this story was developing from the beginning to end. If this is the first time you're clicking on this video and the first time you ever heard about Kendall Ryan, I 100% completely tell you to pick up her books and read this book. And it comes out today. You have a few days of enjoyment because once you start reading this book, you're just going to keep reading it and it's just going to fly by and you're going to really miss it once this ends. But good for you that you can read some more of her books and I 100% recommend that 100% and to 100% recommend reading this book first. I for one couldn't put this book down um, between everything else that's going on in my life that this is this is really really good and I really enjoyed reading this book a lot. I want to say thank you to Kendall Ryan for allowing me to have an advanced copy of this book and getting to read this awesome story like and to be able to share this story with you guys today now and I just really really am happy that I got a chance to read this book because it was something that I needed now and something to uh, deep dive in and to escape my reality and to be involved with this book reality and I just really really love this story. The Penthouse Prince is really really good. This book, The Penthouse Prince, is definitely worth your time, worth your money, worth your um, reading eyes. It's worth everything for you to just to pick up and read every day and or take how long you want to read it. And it's just amazing. It's a, a book that you really, really should really read and just to just cool off and just read like a fun story and to just be happy in the moment. So I really hope I didn't leave anything out in this book and I didn't want to like go overboard and spoil anything thing that you want to find out in the back of the book and I just want to give you my take on this book I really hope you do read this book because I really love the Pentile Prince and it's a book that everyone should read and I always recommend books that I love and I couldn't put down and um, if it's not a book that I didn't like I wouldn't make a video and I really really enjoyed and loved this book because it's really good I enjoyed reading this one and enjoyed reading Lexington's and Corgan's story and I, I just wanted more of their story when I finished. Like I said the ending of, of the epilogue chapter was really good and it made me smile so thank you so much Kendall Ryan for writing this book and to giving us Lexington Dane and Corgan Stewart story. They're amazing. They're amazing two people. I always really would love to, to like meet all these characters that I read. They are all really pretty cool and I just really enjoyed this book so thank you so much for watching and I hope you buy this book today and to read it and to love it just as much as I have but if you are going to read this book go down below and give this video a like please and if you are interested in to hearing more book reviews go down below subscribe to my YouTube channel see all the other book reviews that I've read because there are going to be lots more I promise you and uh thank you so much for watching I really enjoyed this book really really enjoyed giving you this book review I'm glad you stopped by and gave me some of your time to hear me tell you about this awesome book that I really enjoyed and hopefully you will enjoy too. So thank you so much for watching and I will catch you back next week with something amazing and awesome. I promise you. Bye!